I had heard even before I came here for the very first time uh, about the concerts and the different events and the public figures. So I think when you're coming into a building like this for the first time, part of it is what you visually see, but part of it is kind of an aura that comes from knowing all of the fantastic things that have happened within the building. And so for me, it was an important aspect in my recruitment in knowing uh, that you're going to work every day in a place that has that type of history and that has the capacity to be able to do more historic things in the future. Well, it's been such an iconic building and, and it's, uh, it's borne the test of time. Uh, it was a long shot to get built and uh, it's had such a profound effect on, on the university and on the Cedar Valley and indeed the entire state of Iowa. If you do something, do it right, or you're going to have to do it over. Well, when they built this thing 40 years ago, somebody did it right. It really does demonstrate the University of Northern Iowa being visionary from a long, long time ago. And certainly today, um, not only the vision, the exponential impact of the Uni Dome to the Cedar Valley is unmatched. The Unidome is just not a, a building. It's just not a stadium. It's a historic site. And when you really think about uh, the University of Northern Iowa, most people refer to the Unidome. So the Unidome is a historical landmark. We have an unbelievable opportunity recruiting student athletes, coaches. This environment provides something that other stadiums can't. One of the things I think that has been important for the Unidome is, is the extent to which the university has always desired to share it. As I think of the perfect events for the Unidome, uh, the state high school football playoffs always come to mind. It's just a, a perfect venue for that championship, and yet it's also many people's first introduction to Cedar Falls and the University of Northern Iowa. Students coming in, they were like me. They're trying to make their mark. They not only win, but perform. I never played in high school in any arena like the Unidome. I can tell you that right now. It's not all about sporting events. We did a lot of truck and tractor pulls, and we did a lot of Willie Nelson concerts, and we did a lot of closed circuit boxing, and um, you know all, all of the concerts that were, were very high profile. The Fleetwood Mac concert was uh, in college, and. Uh, I have a twin brother and he came watch it and, and I brought a girl along and that was the first time that he got to meet my future wife. It's one of those buildings in the state that if you're going to see big time entertainment, big time athletics, you count the Unidome among those places where you have memories and where you can count on coming and having a good experience. If we're doing athletics the right way, it's going to have a bigger impact across campus. It's gonna get more people to know the University of Northern Iowa. It's gonna get more people interested in the programs that we have here, not just the sports programs, but the academic programs as well. You always talk about the athletics program and its facilities being the front porch of the university. And indeed, the Unidome has been the front porch for the University of Northern Iowa. Somehow, some way, the dome is what will be the first thing that will draw them to the university so that we can open up the doors to the rest of the university so they can see how great a place this is. Whenever we have students come here, they all want to go in the dome. Everybody wants to walk out in the dome, get their picture taken, look up, and then we say, we use this for academics. And their eyes get wide and it's like, oh, that's pretty special. Track and field theory, basketball theory, uh, all kinds of things that we can do in here from an educational standpoint. I don't even think you can measure the impact that it has on students. The Dome is timeless. People want to be here, you know, competing, whether it's football or track or even uh, softball. You know, the facility for the athletes is fantastic. You know, now the next transition is make it a fantastic facility for the fans. I think the investments that are planned uh, to take place is only going to take the Unidome to heights that is, is never seen.
The Unidome project, I would venture to say, will be the most important project that we've ever done. It's certainly the, the biggest project that we've ever done and the one that will require the most financing, the most investment. But when we do this and when we get this done, I believe, and I think we all believe, that it will have the biggest impact of any facility project that we've ever done. We know that pre-COVID, the economic impact from the Unidome was approximately 17 million annually. We know that's only gonna grow exponentially as the facility expands and is enhanced and the visitor experience is even, even greater. That's definitely uh, a dollar amount that we don't want to go away. Um, and we only know we'll grow uh, with this project and we're really excited about the investment that's being made. When I make a gift, I don't just give, I invest. I'd have a hard time identifying a project right now in this area that has the potential for greater impact than the Unidome renovation. We're to the stage now that the gift that you decide to give, should you decide, will last for the next 40 years. Somebody else is going to be sitting in this chair, somebody that played in here, somebody that went to school here, maybe a high school football player. It might be your grandson or your granddaughter that runs track here. I can't even fathom what my time at UNI as an athlete would have been without the Dome. This was like the deciding factor in me coming to UNI. We have to continue to support our student athletes with this facility that so many different programs can use. This is an opportunity for the Panther family to come together, to pull together and show that this facility is important to us, it's important to our future, and it's important to everything that we want to be able to do as a Panther family. So we really need people to come together, uh, pull together and make an investment in this facility for the future of UNI Athletics and for the future of UNR.